welcome to another video walk on the wild side and i'm here in blackpool i'm in talbot square here and uh it's a sunday around about half past ten in the morning and we've actually got armed forces we've had armed forces week going all week in blackpool actually some events going on and today this morning they've actually got the um an event going on here at the cenotaph uh, so they've closed the promenade off this is talbot square talbot square is closed off as well so there's no traffic around here it's completely quiet around here so i don't even know if they're letting the trams up they must be letting the trams up mustn't it to north station but anyway armed forces um, event coming up now at the seventh half and uh, i thought i'd film it for you no connection to the armed forces in my family but i know it does mean a lot to some people so i thought i've never covered this before so i thought what i'd do for a change i think i've seen it in passing a few times you know but i think i passed it on the tram once so I thought this time I'll uh, I'll uh, see what it's all about. So let's go and check it out, shall we? So here's a look at uh, Talbot Square, looking pretty quiet, but there's a lot of people heading this way towards the cenotaph. Look at this; it's a bit breezy. It's not very warm as well. I can tell you that that weather that we had um, last week, that bit of a heat wave, is gone. <laughs> completely let's have a look this way as you can see they've closed the the promenade all the way from where where they closed it from i think they've closed it from central pier maybe it, it's quite a big expanse of promenade that they've closed because they're going to have a they're going to have a parade i think so i'll just give you a pan round Lots of people outside the North Pier here. Look at this. So I've just been speaking to a gentleman outside the North Pier who watches the channel and uh, he's told me that they've actually stopped the trams going up to the station at the moment. I don't know how long for. I'd probably say until about noon maybe, I don't know. This one's going to Fleetwood Ferry, of course. There you go. Well, at the moment, yeah, they've uh, they've stopped the tram. There's going to be a parade once they've done the survey. The parade is going to come from over there, of course, the cenotaph. They're going to line up over there, and they're going to come this way, and they're going to make the way along the promenade and uh, head down this way. Yeah, so uh, we'll wait and see what happens. Well, I can hear a band playing. Let's go and have a look over here, shall we? Check out this Range Rover here. A Barra, Barra Gazai. Wow. Security business is uh, not a bad business to be in, is it? <laughs> it's pretty busy. Have a look at this. spotted by a couple of them yeah <laughs> and uh, just talking to a security guy there and yeah check it out we're here by the the cenotaph of course there yeah there it is yeah the Blackpool cenotaph and uh, I think they're gonna have like a bit of a service here and then they'll after that they'll all line up into like a parade and they'll head along the promenade but I'll tell you what it's a good job it's not raining I can say that much but it is a little bit breezy and that breeze is coming from the northwest and uh, it's a little bit chilly I have to say well it's good to see we haven't got the usual crowd in the shelters while we have this service 
for the armed forces here in Blackpool. Can't beat a brass band, can you? I can hear a piper now. I want to give you a good look round, so we'll give you a little look here, lower walk. We'll head up here now to Prince Princess Parade. Get a good look round the whole thing. As you can see they've closed closed it off. So they're, they're doing a bit of a thing there underneath the centre. Probably laying wreaths there. It's all looking nice here, nice nicely mowed, the grass. Council do a great job looking after this. from the council. Speaker system set up all around so we can hear the music. It's a decent crowd. Roller Hall, 
as we in our life grow old, age shall not weary them, nor the years come down. On the going down of the sun, and in the morning, we will remember them. <laughs> When you go home, tell the mother and say, for your tomorrow, we give our today. I was watching the television as part of the 80th anniversary of the D-Day landings earlier this month, and an 18-year-old young man called Zach was interviewed. He told the story of his great-great-uncle Fred, who was part of the British Exhibitionary Force, having lied about his age to join early. He showed a worn Bible that was moulded in the shape of his hand, that had travelled with him throughout the years of service of his uncle from 1939 to 1945. Watch all your videos. Thank Absolutely you. brilliant. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that did he see him? <laughs> I can tell you from the Midlands. We've been here three, three, been three, three days. They've been looking for you, all we have. Oh, they all say that. They all come looking for me. You just <laughs> got to get lucky and bump into me. <laughs> well, I've come down here to film this, obviously, the armed services. Yeah. So. Yeah, so that's what's going on today. Yeah. So look out the video. I'll probably have it up later. I'll have a yeah, video yeah. trip later. Nice to see you anyway. And you take care. Bye. With the creator God, with the words, the Lord is my shepherd. The words change from this. So I just bumped into some fans of the channel from the Midlands there. So I've made my way all the way around. They're still on with the service. I think they'll be pretty pleased with the with the weather. As he held on to his Bible, Just a bit of a wind, that's all. Thank you. On the beaches, <laughs> Walk on the wild side. <laughs> that's me. <laughs> County Durham. We oh, come from County right. Durham. Oh, right, yeah. all the time. I need to go up there, don't I, sometime? Yeah, yes, yeah. Yes, yes. Thank you. When you look around the world, the most sought after commodity, peace, seems to be very elusive, but we in our islands are fortunate. Could it be because we have the finest forces, the Army, the Navy and the Air Force, which are the role model for the world as our protectors? Are you soldiers because you want to test yourselves and prove yourselves, or is it for adventure? 
perhaps the inspiration comes from what late John F. Kennedy said, and I quote, ask not of your country what it can do for you. Ask what you can do for your country. You understand, peace does not come easy. So we've just had the national anthem and the service is starting to come to a close now I think and they'll be having a bit of a parade out here but anyway I bumped into another local YouTuber it's uh, Paul from the Blackpool Lads and we've also got what's your name? Jason from Daily Vlog Adventures Jason from Daily Vlog Adventures I've, you know, I've been waiting to bump into you for ages <laughs> I know it's been a, been a bit so but Paul's down here filming the the goings on here so check out uh, the Blackpool Lads and Daily Vlog Adventures Daily Vlog Adventures there you go so the uh, service is now over and we've got look at this guy here he's holding this big uh, scepter there look so quite a few of these people were talking It's Paul there. Paul from Tram Town. Got a bit of a way from Paul. Yeah, so don't forget to follow the Blackpool lads on YouTube. I'll put a link in the description and also Jason's channel Daily Vlog Adventures and that was the Armed Forces service here at the Blackpool Cenotaph. The service is now over and uh, we'll see if they all come out and do a bit of a parade now along the promenade. So people are all coming out of there now. Well I hope you like the video. Um, I've done my best to bring you the service and as you can see now we've got loads of people lined up along the promenade now we're waiting for this uh, parade I'll just give you a look the other way there you go all the way over there we managed to get through it without any rain just about it's starting to spit now though so there you go I can hear the distant sound of bagpipes, I think they're on the way.
so there you go that was the armed forces service here in blackpool on a sunday and the uh, the parade as well i hope you like the video i've done my best to bring it to you i've never managed to cover it before i've only managed to see it when i've been i think i've ma managed to catch catch it when i was passing on a tram once so i know quite a few people would want to see it so i've done my best to bring it to you and don't forget to tune into the blackpool lads as well because they were covering it and also jason's channel daily vlog adventures shout out to them first time i've actually met them so there you go check those out as well anyway that's it for this video i hope you like it if you do hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos and i'll see you again on the next one